What up everyone? James here from Let Go Printing and Number One Nog on Instagram. Today we are going to be printing the Marlboro cigarette pack with metaphorical anti-smoking warning. Check it out. So I proofed the print a few times, changed the print order around a few times, and check out the print. I think it's looking pretty great. Here's my hand for reference. Nice detail. Getting some nice tonal variation in here. Nice color blending and the red printing on top of the black. You can kind of see the cellophane-y vibe of the print. Love it. If I had anything to say about it, it's that maybe the cigarette filters here in the warning are a little bit hot, a little bit orange. They could be toned down. Maybe there's a little bit more, too much red going down there. Let's see how the print comes together. I'm using a 200 mesh here with a 50-50 low bleed cotton white mixture. Uh, 50 line half tone, 33 degrees. Pretty solid underbase there. Now let's see what happens when we add the colors. Just laid down the yellow, 230 mesh, again, 50 line half tone, 33 degrees. See how it's playing in here, and across the banner there. It's kind of hot. It's kind of all over the place. Here's a gray. The gray is filling in a bit of the metaphorical warning. It's also doing a bit of modeling in here and in there. Next is the black. And you can see how the black is really doing wonders for the knuckles of the hands there. And it's also printing pretty solid in there and defining the letters in here. Red 185. Wow, damn. Look at that. Looks like maybe we're, we're getting a little too much ink right here. But I like how this looks. It really softens everything, printing wet on wet after the black. And we still have a little bit of cellophane right here. Perhaps the red was separated a little heavy wherever it's hitting on top of the yellow because it looks a little like it's shifting into the orangey red zone. Last but not least, the white, 230 mesh, 70 durometer squeegee. Look at that. Nice smooth print. Because we're printing the white wet on wet, there's small dots, maybe six or seven, eight percent dots in here that aren't necessarily printing, or if they are, they're getting blended with the red, which is the nice part about printing wet on wet. So there's our print, people. We're gonna flash it, run it through the dryer. 